So I think from my point of view, GFC is an engineering company and we just happen to make campers. From that perspective, our goal is to make all of our processes and our, our systems as efficient and optimized as possible so that we can move everything through and hit those dates and those deliveries that we have for customers. The reason why our system is a pull system and the reason why we make the camper when you order it, we don't keep anything in stock. And we do that because we have a lot of different variations. We want the customer to have the ability to get the exact camper that they want, the exact camper that they build. Since we have such a big engineering division and we have such engineering power within GFC, we have a lot of control, not only the manufacturing processes, but our backend stuff, our softwares that then feed those manufacturing processes and allow us to be very vertically integrated um, in terms of bending our own panels, sewing our own tents, uh, machining all of our own parts, which then allows us to support that pull system and that Kanban system and keep all of our parts in stock whenever we need them. We've come a really long way, um, thanks to all of these different tools that we've employed. Uh, now, cycle time is four days. First day of manufacturing, we're cutting, bending, and riveting the panels for the camper, and at the same time, we're also starting the tent. So we're getting all of the components of the tent that need to be heat pressed, put together. Day two, we're sending those panels to our powder coater, and then they come back and get staged for the next day, and we're also sewing the tent together at the same time. Day three, um, we're assembling the panels and collecting all of the parts that go into a camper. And at the same time, we're machining all of the beams that go into the camper as well. And then day four, all of the stuff comes together in our final assembly area and the camper is built and pushed out the door, ready for install.